Hello everyone and welcome to CAD CAM C tutorials. Here in this video we are going to create a helix with variable pitch that you can see on the screen right now. So here we can see that at the bottom and the top the pitch is high but at the center the pitch is low. So let's begin it. So let us first close this. We'll go to the file, create a new part and OK. Now first we'll make background plain white. So we'll select here plain white. Now first we have to create a helix and for that we'll go to the insert. Select here cow, helix or spiral. Now first we have to create cross section of the helix. In our case it is circle. And for that we have to define sketching plane. In our case we'll define top plane as a sketching plane. Now here we'll create a circle with diameter of 100 mm. So we'll specify here 50 mm as radius and OK. So this will be the cross section of the helix and after creating this sketch we'll exit the sketch. Once we'll exit the sketch and if we go to the isometric view it will give us the preview of the helix that is going to be created. In our case, we will define the helix with the use of pitch and revolution. That means we will define pitch as a function of revolution. So let us say that for the revolution 0, our pitch is of 20 mm. When the revolution will be 5, my pitch will also be 5. And we will add one more when the revolution is 10, my pitch should be 20 again. So that means first we are reducing the pitch and then we are increasing the pitch. So from 0 to 5, it will gradually reduce from 20 to 5. From 5 to 10, it will gradually increase from 5 to 20. And then just click on OK. So here we can see that it has created helix with variable pitch. In order to make it solid object, what we can do is we can go to the sweat boss feature. Here we'll select circular profile as a cross section with the diameter of 5 mm. And then we have to select here the curvature or what we can say the path. So for the path, we can select here this helix and you can see the preview of the body and click on OK. Now if you want to hide this helix curve just click on the helix and select here hide. In order to give it a color we can click on the part right click appearance and select here part and we can select any of the color and OK. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you like this video, then please hit on the like button, share it and subscribe to this channel CADCAM CE Tutorials. Thanks.